We are learning new details about a gyrocopter crash in Chico yesterday that sent two people to the hospital. Action News Now reporter Lauren Cooper went back to the crash site today on El Monte Avenue and spoke with neighbors who saw it go down. It's just, it's the oddity of it, I, I think, and, and um, I just hope the people are all right. There is still a lot of anxiety in the neighborhood after what officials are now calling a gyrocopter crashed into the backyard of a Chico home here on El Monte Avenue and East 8th Street. The sound was weird. There was obviously some kind of issue with the engine um, that it became high pitched. These were the sounds neighbor Henry Marine heard moments before it happened right next door to his own home. You know, it wasn't very loud when it crashed, so I going from that high pitched sound to the crash, I was like, okay, somebody's drone fell. And then I started to hear some people yelling and, and some screaming. It was in that moment that Marine and his brother sprung into action, with him calling 911 and his brother jumping the fence into their neighbor's yard to help. He said the woman was semi-conscious and panicked. Marine's brother talking her through turning the engine off just in time. The National Transportation Safety Board says the husband and wife in the copter have serious injuries. The National Transportation Safety Board and the Butte County Sheriff's Office both tell me they cannot release the identities of the two people involved in the crash, but we're going to keep working to find out more information. I'm Lauren Cooper reporting in Chico, Action News Now. The Federal Aviation Administration is examining the scene before the wreckage can be relocated to a secure spot for further investigation.